Time now for our top plays of the week, starting with number five, Maria Trival Piece. We go back to the ground game, that orange and blue of the Alamo City, UTSA. They've lacked firepower on offense throughout the year. Owen McCown says, how about this for firepower? Launches it up for Patrick Overmeyer in the end zone. The lefty launches it, and the big-time tight end comes down with it. 42 yards for the touchdown, putting the Roadrunners up 10-7 in the second quarter in that matchup that was really tightly contested with Florida Atlantic. I love that. Patrick Overmeyer just saying, give me the ball. He's like, I in will. In double coverage, too. Right, right? He looked so good. I mean, in a great throw from Owen McCown, that's definitely deserving of a top play award for the week love it but another team that had a top play worthy was heading over to temple for some volleyball temple looking really good resiliency another key Maria. word we had a rally last week some more rallies here how about charlotte at one point in this match went on Thanks, a 10 and 0 run wow. but temple coming back you see a good dig right there they keep it open this is going to be set and match point serving it up right here for sydney jones boom Kill. How about that? Temple wins. I think that one might need to be a little higher. You think, think so? Yeah. Are you talking about match point? I know. With it being that I know. tightly contested? That one's tough. I know. Credit it was to tough. the Temple Owls in that regard. Got it, it done. I did. Got it did. done. All right. Number three, another week, another Bryson Daly top play in the American Athletic Conference. Captain America says, this is about Glenn Powell, not Chris Evans, because he goes twisters on the defense of East Carolina. He says, there ain't no love in West Point, New York, baby. I'm going twisters to the end zone and making it for six again. Not the only time Bryson Daly's made not only top plays, but he's found his way to pay dirt, one of the top rushing quarterbacks and rushing attacks in all of football across the board. Give me the Army Black Knights, baby. Bryson Daly does it again. That might have been one of my favorite references that you've ever made. <laughs> wow, so perfectly executed. And speaking of perfectly executed, I guess, plays, we'll head over to the soccer pitch with Charlotte. This is Sydney Smith from midfield, Kyle. Ooh. Right into the back of the net. Wow. Do you know how much strength that that takes to get that ball all the way? She was Look at, at the that. At the circle. I I know. That's what I'm saying. How that's that why fair? I don't know. Number two play for sure. I, I, I need that strength. I need like what her leg day regimen is because yeah. I, I want to be that strong. I bet it's significant. That's impressive. Yeah. Very nicely done. Sydney Smith. Charlotte's rolling on the soccer pitch, by the way. All right. Final one of the day. Let's go to Annapolis. Charlotte Navy midshipman already up big. Deshaun Peel undercuts the route, takes it 60 yards to the house. Big time play from the Navy defender. And But guess what? He wasn't done just yet. Few drives later, he drops back in coverage. His second interception of the day. But there's no way he's going to take this back to the house, right? wrong he's going all the way back through that charlotte team back and forth weaving his way in and out of offensive players and then he just barrels over a guy at the end zone ain't no regard for human life in the navy defense <laughs> they take it all the way back to the house not once but twice credit to sean peel back to back pick sixes first one in the american conference to do so he looked so fast <laughs> on those I think that was my favorite part like, I know but it was just like the strength the physicality and the speed it's like the perfect way you know to not get one but two pick sixes in a game second American conference player I should say first in Navy Navy history, history. I had my notes yes. backwards yes. but regardless incredible stuff from the Navy midshipmen and the defense as well the midshipmen have had everything working in their favor Annapolis is a tough place to play right now and it's because of that defense and the tone that they set the defense the offense we covered so much Army and Navy today Kyle oh my goodness what a show of all American <sighs>